Ladies and gentlemen, classical family, it's your boy Giri back with another reaction. Hope you guys are doing good. I'm doing great. Today we are reacting to Liebestraum. Liebestraum. So that's a German word. It's love stream or a love dream. Yeah, a love dream. A love dream makes more sense. But yeah, we are reacting to Liebestraum number three from a list played by Arthur Rubenstein. So, yeah, a lot of you recommended me this one and a hey, shout out to your classical family. You guys recommended me so many classical pieces that were up to 10 minutes and yeah, I really appreciate it. Keep them coming and I'll try and upload more videos next week. So just watch out for that and thank you again. But yeah, let's get right into the reaction. Let go. That was wonderful. I wonder if you'd forgive me if I made a special request. My favorite record is your recording of Liebestrom. I've played it so often I've worn it out. It'd be nice to hear it without scratch. All right. Liebestrom without scratch. <laughs> Such a beautiful melody.
Wow. <laughs> that was such a beautiful melody. Such a beautiful melody. You see, I was, um, I was looking at him at the end. I was looking at uh, Rubenstein at the end when he was playing it and I was trying to figure out what he was thinking about. Obviously, I can't figure that out. Like, you can't, you can't know what somebody's thinking about, obviously, when they're like playing a piece, but I really wanted to know what he was thinking about. And sometimes I feel like when you're playing a certain piece, the melody can trigger a certain memory. It can be a good memory or it can be a bad memory, but sometimes the piece can trigger a certain memory and I think you're playing the piano and the whole time you're thinking about that certain memory and I feel like that that's what was going on with him. I might be wrong, but yeah, I think that was that was what was going on with Rubinstein when he was playing this piece, but it's a very beautiful melody and yeah, Liebestraum, I think it's the perfect title for that, for this piece. Whenever I listen to a piece like that or whenever I listen to a piece that sounds this romantic, so warm and loving, I just I only remember or I only have good memories in my head and start appreciating the people that love me a lot and the people that are there for me, the people that care for me. And yeah, this, this is the certain type of memory that this piece triggered for me. So yeah, it's a very beautiful piece. Let me know what what memory this piece triggers, triggers for you. Like when you listen to it, what's the first memory that you think of? I really wanna know because um, yeah, I'm kinda curious, I'm kinda curious. It's it's a special piece. It's definitely a special piece and um in case there's another version out there, like you guys are like, oh this version doesn't sound so good, let me know and I'll react to that one too because I found this one and there's also another one, but I just reacted to this one because it had the video and I just wanted to see him play it. So if you've got another version out there just send it to me and I'm going to react to that one too because I'm definitely loving this piece. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the reaction. Please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. It's been your boy Giri. I'm going to catch you on the next video. Bye.